In Iraq today, there was a major show of force by hundreds of armed civilians. They're part of a growing Shia militia, volunteers who are taking up arms in an effort to battle the Sunni extremists known as the Islamic State of Iraq and Syria. Today, the ISIS fighters made additional gains, and as Jacques Rabot reports, that's heightening fears of a sectarian showdown. As Sunni militants continue to seize territory in Iraq, the country's Shiites are sending a powerful message that they're ready to fight. Thousands of heavily armed Shia militiamen paraded through the streets of Baghdad, along with trucks loaded with weaponry, including rocket launchers. Similar shows of force on display in the cities of Kirkuk and Amara, responding to the call of a leading Shia cleric. We urge you to be ready to sacrifice yourselves and defend this beloved country, said this representative of cleric Muqtada al-Sadr. The call to action seen as necessary because Iraq's army has failed to contain ISIS, the Sunni jihadists, despite the fact the Iraqi army has better weaponry and training. There's been no military formations actually conducting a battalion sized mobile attack against a bunch of guys in jeans and a t-shirt with AK-47s and a couple of magazines. And the Iraqi army's shortcomings are being highlighted once again. Sunni militants seizing control of a border town with Syria that will allow them to more easily move men and weapons from their bases in that country. And the fallout from the fighting can be seen in Kirkuk, where Shia families have fled after their villages were targeted by ISIS militants. They came shooting anti-aircraft guns, mortars and artillery, said Abu Fala. We have lived with Sunnis and there were never any problems, but where these people came from, we don't know. So far, Shia militias, despite their martial displays, are staying on the sidelines. But if they move onto the battlefield, it could trigger a bloody sectarian war in a region already engulfed in conflict. Jopper Bo, Global News. It's that fear of Iraq on the brink of a bloody sectarian war that brought out members of Calgary's Muslim community today. All Muslim United against Isa. Shiites and Sunnis join forces in a rally against ISIS, the Sunni extremist group that has seized a lot of territory in northern Iraq. There is also concern that several young Muslims from Calgary have traveled to Iraq and joined ISIS, news that shocked the city's Muslim community. And they showed up here today to make it clear they do not support the radical terrorist organization.